hi guys welcome back to my youtube channel so in this video i'm going to show you how you can be able to solve a problem which um, i'm facing currently right now so um this is one of my clients you know um website now um i got like a message that anytime they try to go over there um this is what happened it doesn't really open it redirects them to a different website okay so let's let's take a look at how it behaves so this is the website okay so at the moment it finished loading up it redirects them to a different place so that is it it redirects you to a different place to a website i don't really know about okay so um when you try to go back you know it goes to another link again it keeps doing the same thing re redirecting you to a different place when you try to go back it doesn't really go you go again the same thing happens it goes to a different place okay so um i'm going to um show you how i'll be able to solve this problem and then let's log in okay so as you can see um at the moment we log in first things first you need to update um everything that you have to update all the plugins and everything because it might be that um, some of the plugins ha um w was you know vulnerable and then somebody a hacker you know injected those kind of codes into the um, the website so what we have to do is the files of the website what we have to do is go to update and then update all your update all your plugins and other things that you have to update make sure that every the website is uh, wordpress is up to date all your plugins are up to date okay so let's update the um you know the the version of the wordpress first okay so after updating let's go back to um over here and go to update again and let's check the update okay so there are this all these plugins need to be updated okay so what we have to do is select all and then click on update okay very good so now that the theme and the plugins and everything webs uh, wordpress is updated now let's go to the next part of the tutorial let's hover on plugins over here click on add new and then search for a plugin called word fans word fans okay word fans this one this plugin is what we are looking for okay this plugin over here so as you can see it's about 4 million plus active installations okay so click on install now and then click on activate okay very good so now that the plugin is installed and activated to complete the installation just enter your email address over here and then tick this one to accept the terms and condition and also make sure that you choose between this one yes or no okay you read over there and then you choose i'll choose no and then click on continue okay and then this one they will tell you to enter your premium key over there we are not using the premium version we just click on over here no thanks now we've installed the plugin now let's go down over here and then locate where the word fence is down over here okay and then click on scan now we want to scan our, our website for any um you know virus or any uh, malicious code that is what within our what our website the files of the website so um just click on start new scan over here okay guys so as you can see the scan is what complete and then we have two things over here okay so malware scan we have a problem over there and then public files do we have a problem over there so we're going to check it so you see that the files will be dropped over here okay so as you can see this one these files appear to be malicious or unsafe that is this one okay now this one slice map dot php i don't really know um what it is okay so it is critical so over here you can either ignore or you can check the details now when you check the details this is what is in it okay and this code appears to be what um you know from um uh, what do you call it like a malware okay code okay so what i'm going to do is i'm going to delete it okay i don't need it so i'll delete that one and then over here this one says what um the public accessible config backup or whatever file okay there is a problem over there so what we're going to do is we're going to check the details of it and then this one okay so as you can see they said that there is what a problem over there so you can decide to what to delete it okay because if there is a problem it means that something is wrong somewhere okay so um it that file can be found over here okay that is a de uh, debug log dot log okay they said it is what publicly accessible and may expose source code 
or sensitive information about your website fetch files such as this uh, files such as this are one are commonly checked for by scanner um, sc scanners and should be made inaccessible okay so what we're going to do is um we have to fix it okay it's either you fix it or you delete it okay that is the main thing but before that since we've deleted the first file let's try and see if the website is still redirecting us to um you know what well how we were um you know seeing it so let's check and see if it's still redirect us then we tackle the next one guys so as you can see this even though it is critical it is not as critical as um you know the first one because we deleted the first one the problem is what is solved it is not um directing um you know uh, redirecting us to a different place again and that is what and that is it, it means that the slice dot um slice map dot php file was the uh, the one which the 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 the, the hackers in um, you know installed on the on the file on the wordpress okay and this file give them what um you know access to it okay so you need to check it in your c panel and then make sure that you 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 secure the file okay but then the problem is fixed so i'm not going to do anything over there i can either delete it or i can what i can ignore it so to be able to what uh, make sure that everything works correctly i'm going to de delete that file okay because it is just what a debug file so i'm going to delete it and then i'll close it so now that everything is done what i'm going to do is i'm going to do a new scan and then see if um i see any um you know files again so i'm going to do a new scan okay guys so right now everything is what everything is complete and the website will be working as perfectly as possible so this is it Le let us you know res refresh it again and then let's see if it's redirect us to a different website it doesn't okay so it means that the website is what is fixed it is working okay so make sure that you leave this um you know um uh, this plugin installed to protect your what your website okay so make sure that you leave it installed to protect your website you can choose to go for the premium one to protect your website okay that is it okay guys so there is also another problem the another problem is whereby um there is there are, there are two things the files okay one file will have the slice map.php that one you can delete it okay and the other file too will have what um wp blogger um wp hyphen blogger hyphen header dot php okay now this file is also critical and high okay now what happens is that this one it is easily deleted you can what you can delete it okay and then it will, it will solve the problem but this file it is a file that is needed in wordpress okay so you cannot just delete it okay so what you have to do is um you have to check it and check the differences okay now that the means that they have what the original file is different from the um the one that it is what installed on your website right now the one that is on your website so when you check the differences you can see you can see that this is what um the original file okay the original version of the file this is it and then this is the modified version on your wordpress system and this is what um you know someone or the hackers have what modified it and installed on your what on your system on your hosting okay so you need to what and make sure that you repair it or you delete this one and then replace it with what with this one okay so to solve that one what we need to do is let's go back to our dashboard okay and then it is as easy as possible now you see this button over here just click repair okay it will tell you that are you sure you want to repair blah 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 just just click on what repair okay just click on repair or they will tell you to what copy it okay so first you just uh, make sure that you click to what to um you know download the file and then you what you click on repair now it will what it will repair the file for you and then you what you close it okay the same way you do the same thing to this one okay it will tell you to what click to what to download okay and then you what you repair it make sure so the file has been already been what restored already okay because we did for the first one is the same file okay so that is it now after that 
your website is well done you can now go ahead to scan it again okay just do a scan again and then it will be what it will be done okay guys so as you can see it is what it is completely scanned okay so everything is what complete so now your website will what work as perfect as you want okay so i hope this video helps you to be able to what solve this problem thank you for watching and see you in the next video bye bye